new act for Focus Elder New. David McDonald, Steve Dorothy, who have never played at Focus Elder New before, is that correct? That is correct. So here it is for the first time. Please welcome Pizza Resistance. Queensland Folk Fest uh, Federation itself. 
a lot into the folk rag and a lot into the folk he's old and new and also continues to do so, continues to support a lot of the work that Michael is doing, that Mary's doing, that everybody does for the folk rag. So he also has played it's a bit of the history at the third folk he's old and new with June, the third folk he's old and new with the Wayfarers, the eighth Folk is old and new, and the 29th Folk is old and new as well. So please welcome to the stage for the 50th Folk is old and new, Don Nichols. Not used to being MC'd. Used to being the MC -er rather than MC E. <laughs> Don, there is a successful Don fitting in there. That's how much better than what that She's a woman. Oh, shit! You're getting this on video, are you? Yeah. Incriminating. I'm not entirely used to playing on my own, uh, as Anne said, I've played in a lot of groups. I really get a buzz out of playing with groups and for dances and things like that. Latterly, I suppose, I've done the odd. It's sort of very odd. <laughs> Spotted Aberfolk, something in Mulaney. Oh, we're going to see if you're ever up there on the first Saturday of the month. Uh, and I'm not the only thing on, I can assure you. So. Dear me. This was down in Victoria during the bushfire. I don't know if that's any excuse. The blows hop down the valley. He 
reminds me of a girl that I knew long ago. Her hair was as fair as the snow in the sun. B. 
Oh! 
you. This next song was collected by Peter Kennedy from a track called Jim Small, no relation to Sergeant, of Cheddar in England. Despite appearances, It's a song I've also sung quite often really, and it's, uh, those of you who know it, please join in. It's, it's poignant, it's poignant for a number of reasons. And I suppose as we look back on 50 folk geese all the years, it's just a bit of a song for the people who aren't here anymore. Including people who very recently passed, I'm afraid. What's the life of a man any more than a leaf? A man has a season, so why should he grieve? For although through this life we appear fine and gay, like a leaf we must wither and soon fade away. I was a walking one morning with ease, viewing the leaves that had fell from the trees, all in full motion appearing to be. Those that had withered, they fell from the tree. What's the life of a man any more than a leaf? A man Oh. Uh -huh. 
the night coming on, those two little babies sat under a stone. They sobbed and they sighed, they lay down and died, cried, cried. <laughs> those two little babies, they lay down and died. Pretty babies in the wood, pretty babies. They sped, they put out their wide wings and over them spread. And all the day long in the branches they thronged, and sweetly did whistle, and this was their song. Pretty babes in the wood, pretty babes. Anyway, here we 
we go. It's, it's a lovely love song, really. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, 
Videotaping you. All these people, the proofreaders, uh, they, I've, I've probably forgotten somebody really important. Um, I'm winging it. Um, hadn't thought about this. Song. Just why? Yes. <laughs> then, anyway, I have to thank them. And of course, Ernest for putting up for all this. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, our first song uh, is a thing by Ed, Ed Bruce. He used to uh, write stuff for John Cash. Uh, it's called Everything's a Waltz. And a few people seem to all know it, so sing on. We don't dance in the
I don't know. T-shirts and jeans, you all look the same. That's right. And I can't talk because I'm up there as well. Um, a little bit of extra stuff. There are some other concerts that are happening here at Cloverly. Bush and the terrible things that's happened up north and then 
Victoria, and, and we really is part of our spiritual inheritance, I guess, is the, the bush. So I think all the songs I'm doing uh, with Tom Lader and with um, Ian and Don, and um, it's, uh, most of the ones I do with Rose are Australian tunes. And the first one is uh, I've joined a tune and a song together. The tune is a Queensland tune. And I got it from Gregor Larry in, uh, in Victoria, funnily enough. It originally came from a, um, a drover in, uh, I think, in the Sunshine Coast, Tinterland, in about the 1950s, whose uh, his name was Laurie Cobley. And because he was an Aboriginal, they always got the rough end of the stick. And Laurie often found that his, uh, his main job was riding around the cattle at night, uh, doing the night shift, you know, just keeping the cattle together. And he'd do this by playing his harmonica, you know, in the way that you've probably seen Americans do it, but this, uh, this was an Australian guy, and this is the tune that he played, and it was collected, and Greg had it under the name of Laurie Cobley's Cattle Lullaby. <laughs> <laughs> it's a much nicer tune than the title. And uh, I've put it together with a tune uh, that you'll know, and you can uh, hopefully join in. Oh, 
Now, apparently, I'll be displaying most of the fruit of my loins here tonight. So we get Tom up to start with, and as you know, Tom apparently played at the Fogies Albany before I did. Apparently. So we're going to. And would never again like to be referred to as the fruit. <laughs> So the, um, the first uh, song we're going to do is against an Australian song, it's from Victoria and it's written by a man called Charles Thatcher who lived, uh, oh, I guess he worked around there in the, about the 1830s to the 1840s, maybe the 1850s and he, uh, his job was to go around all the gold fields and he would play in the music halls and he wrote a lot of songs that appealed to the miners at the time. This one is called the, the, the German Girl, and as you know, during the Gold Rush, a lot of people came to Australia, and um, some stayed, some didn't. Um, uh, and he uh, writes this song about a German girl who's, uh, whose job was to, as the miners um, mine the earth, can't she kind of mine the miners? If you know what I mean? <laughs> and there's lots of terminology in there, which I, I find these songs very interesting, because he uses lots of mining terminology, like, he'll say things like, I soon made such a flame, I thought everybody was going to jump your claim and you'll hear the word showster, which is a bad mine, which he refers to. And um, in this, uh, as part of this, we'll play another Australian tune, a lovely jig called Herb's Jig, and it might be an uh, opportunity just to think kindly of um, Gary and Diane, who must have danced lots to this, um, this tune when we played it with them, what they that. So, here we go with the German girl. I once fell deep in love, sir, with a true colonial wine, with a German girl who played and sang at the Union Bar all day. I just got it as green as grass, me pocket full of tin. When this young lass, she took me up and then she took me in. Well, she sat in the Union Bar and played an old guitar. And soon on be sold, she made a big hole and me cash at the Union Bar. One night I sought that bar, sir, to have me usual chat, but no German girl. Oh, sorry. I shepherded that girl, sir, and soon made such a flame. I thought that every fella there was going to jump me claim. The prospect to I like so much that such a girl I'd meet, that when she sang her German songs it made me hard to be. Well, she sat in the Union Bar and played on an old guitar And soon on me soul she made a big hole in cash at the Union Bar One night I sought that bar, sir, to have me usual chat But no German girl was there, she'd gone to Ballarat I shouted at the bar and got tipsy plain to tell And when I asked him why she went, he said he couldn't tell
Australian tune called the Mudgy Shotish, and then we'll do the poem, the po Pommies Lament, and then we sing the song, the Pommies Lament. So, if you need to go to the toilets, probably. <laughs> one, one, I see the, between two poems. Um, I don't think I can put up with this. Hey, from Australia. Yeah. You, have to, you have to change your accent, you have to change your accent, mate. Um, twice, twice,
this didn't last, I bought myself all dangers past. I'll make a fortune, I'll make it fast in this sunny land of Australia. Yeah. 